Hey friends, welcome. Imagine this. You wake up every morning with an unshakable sense of fulfillment, regardless of what life throws your way. You don't feel weighed down by stress or scarcity. Instead, you feel a deep sense of peace and abundance. It might sound far-fetched, but what if I told you that activating this state of mind is possible, not through external achievements or constantly striving, but through one simple, powerful practice? Gratitude. You see, gratitude is more than just a nice feeling. It's a scientifically proven way to transform your life in profound ways. Today, we'll explore how the simple act of practicing gratitude can unlock a life of joy, fulfillment, and resilience. So, let's dive into the science behind gratitude and why it's your most valuable tool for personal growth. Now, gratitude is often misunderstood as merely saying thank you when good things happen. But it's much more than that. Gratitude is a mindset, a deliberate focus on what we have rather than on what we lack. And when we practice gratitude consistently, it doesn't just improve our mood. It rewires our brain, changing how we perceive and experience the world. Now, let's talk about the science behind this. Neuroscientific studies have shown that gratitude activates regions of the brain associated with dopamine production. Now, the neurotransmitter is responsible for pleasure and reward. And when you practice gratitude, your brain releases more dopamine, which not only makes you feel happier in the moment, but also encourages your brain to seek out more positive experiences. It's a virtuous cycle. The more you practice gratitude, the more you naturally experience feelings of happiness and well-being. Now, one landmark study conducted by Dr. Robert Emmons, one of the world's leading gratitude researchers, found that individuals who kept weekly gratitude journals experienced better physical health, fewer aches and pains, and even exercised more regularly compared to those who didn't practice gratitude. He also discovered that gratitude journaling significantly improved participants' psychological well-being, leading to more positive emotions, higher levels of optimism, and greater life satisfaction. But gratitude does more than just improve our mood. It changes the way we experience challenges. Research published in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology found that people who regularly practice gratitude were better able to handle stress and adversity. They experienced lower cortisol, the body's stress hormone, and had a greater sense of emotional resilience. Why? Because gratitude shifts your focus from what's going wrong to what's going right. Instead of feeling overwhelmed by life's difficulties, you begin to see them in a new light, as opportunities for growth. Another fascinating aspect of gratitude is its impact on relationships. Studies from the University of California show that people who express gratitude toward their partners feel closer and more satisfied in their relationships. Gratitude acts as a powerful social glue, deepening connections and fostering empathy. Now, when we make a habit of recognizing the good in others, we strengthen the bonds we share with those around us. But here's the key. Gratitude is a practice. It's not something that happens by accident. It's a deliberate daily choice to focus on the blessings in your life. And when you do, you experience a shift in perspective. Instead of dwelling on what you lack, you become aware of the abundance that already exists in your life. Whether it's the love of a family member, the joy of a simple meal, or the lessons learned from a difficult experience. This isn't just about feeling good for a moment. Practicing gratitude consistently has long-term benefits for your mental and emotional well-being. In a study published in Frontiers in Psychology, researchers found that practicing gratitude not only improves mood for the short term, 
but also has lasting effects on brain function, increasing the brain's ability to process positive emotions over time. It's like exercising a muscle. The more you practice, the stronger it gets. So, how do you cultivate gratitude? Well, you start by taking a few moments each day to reflect on what you're thankful for. You can keep a gratitude journal or write down three things you're grateful for each day. Or, if writing isn't your style, simply reflect in silence or say it out loud. The key is to be specific. Instead of saying, I am grateful for my family, dig deeper. I am grateful for my spouse who supported me during a tough week. Or, I am grateful for my friend's call today. That made me feel really good and heard. You see, these small moments of gratitude accumulate, creating a profound shift in your mindset. So, as we come to a close, remember this. Gratitude isn't just an emotion. It's a powerful practice that can reshape your entire life. It's about consciously choosing to focus on the good, even in the midst of challenges. The science is clear. Gratitude improves our mental health, it boosts our physical well-being, strengthens our relationships, and rewires our brain to expect more positivity. But the true power of gratitude lies in its simplicity. It's available, of, it's available to all of us at any moment, regardless of our circumstances. The more you practice it, the more you'll discover that you've had the key to a life of abundance and joy all along. So, as you go about your day, remember to pause, reflect, and express gratitude for the blessings, big and small, all around you. And ask yourself, how might your life change if you embrace gratitude every single day? The answer might just transform everything. Thank you. Friends, I hope you have a beautiful day. You're worth so much, and you are so amazing. There are incredible things coming your way. I can't wait to experience them with you. So, I'll be back tomorrow with some more great stuff. I can't wait till then. I'll see you. It'll be great. Take care.